Alright. <laughs> what's up, what's up, what's up? It's Friday. It's still hot out here. We're in Florida. Don't don't forget that. So it's still hot out here. Um we Nuts just boiling. come <laughs> not, well, it's about <laughs> almost eight o'clock, so it, it, it ain't hot it was at twelve o'clock, but you can fry an egg on your on your, <laughs> on your concrete or something like that. But uh crazy week this week, you know, so we just came to try to make a little video or something. Uh this my boy. JT, I'm JP. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But hey, what's the what's the craziest thing you've seen this week? Craziest thing. Yes. Uh that happened today was so me and my boss wanna go get something to drink from the store. It's a homeless dude out there. We already know he about to beg. So we get back into the car. I already evade him, I already take my evasive maneuver. And my boss walked right past him. He asked, uh, can you let him hold something? And I, I guess my boss told him no. So as I'm getting in the car, this is real, real, <laughs> real life. He said, I'll let you get in my ass. <laughs> what? 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 I mean, literally get in. Yeah. In a... Straight face. So. Straight face, dead serious. What kind of work y'all was doing today? <laughs> that you exposed to stuff like that at work. You know what I mean? So I don't know. I ain't never been exposed. I've been exposed to crazy stuff, but not like that. Um, so what, what happened? What happened? Nothing. And, uh, <laughs> you know, my boss, I told him about it. He was like, what? I tell him like three times because he, he didn't believe me. He was, was looking for it? No. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> he was looking for it. Where he at? He, 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 what did he say? Man, I'm going to go get in his <laughs> I'm going to go have a word with him. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but that, that's what he wanted him to do. Yeah. Well, you know what I'm saying? You know, I'm, and now I, I know you, and I know you ain't bashing. Yeah. Homeless people, because I didn't see you take money out of your pocket. Yeah. Your last money. Yeah. Go give it to a homeless person. Yeah. Go in the store, buy buy some water, bring it back out. So I know yeah. you ain't bad. You're just telling the story. Yeah. It just happened to be a person down on his luck in the, in the story. Um, my week crazy from Monday to Friday. You know where I work. Crazy. Mm -hmm. uh, one of the, one of the biggest things is that people ain't accountable for what they do. Yeah. If you do something. Be accountable for what you do. Yeah. If you do it, don't blame me. <laughs> don't blame me because of the choices you yeah. made in your life. Believe me, I got I made my own bad choices. I don't have to I don't wanna take the burden of of taking blame for your bad choices too. Yeah. But you know, um crazy week, crazy life, you know what I mean? But every day that I wake up alive is a good day. Every day that I can make it through week and see another Friday is a good day, so I ain't complaining that could be a lot worse. Yeah. Um, a lot of people in this world got it a lot worse than I do, so I ain't complaining. Manifesting positivity. Manifest. Well, it's Friday. You know, yeah. Friday brings joy to most people. People who ain't got work. You know, it's Friday the 13th. Right. Even though it's Friday. That's right. Dad explained a lot of stuff today. A lot of things going wrong. I almost got into a wreck like three times. Dad explained <laughs> a lot of stuff. <clears throat> but nevertheless, it's Friday. So, Friday we got, I got paid. a couple days. Got paid, touche. Yeah. Touche. I got paid too. So <laughs> cook Friday. Like ice cube. The day was a good day. Um, but well, what you what kind of music you listen to this weekend? What what's on your what's on your phone is gonna be a heavy rotation this weekend? Uh alternative rock, uh I've been listening to <laughs> for real, bro. I've been listening Alternative Rock? Yeah, I've I been listen, I, I, I've been listening to uh, Rolling Plains. Okay. These okay. uh this 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 other group, I don't know. They got the song called uh The Emperor's Clothes and Don't Don't t Don't Test Me with a Good Time or something like that. But that, that's some good music. Okay. And then I also listen to Blake Shelton cuz he got No, I, I I mess with Blake. I mess with Blake. But yeah, um, that good stuff Florida Georgia Line. It was it was a minute I was I was rolling. You remember this? You remember when I was rolling the Florida yeah. Georgia Line hard yeah. for about 2 months. Yeah. I mean, that was a, I mean, I would I would have the windows down and Bumping a little bit, and people <laughs> roll up. We roll up to the red light. They look over me like, "Yeah, wait a minute, you ain't supposed to be listening to music like that." But you know, Florida Georgia Line, Blake, Blake Shelton, music is music. Music makes you feel good, no yeah. matter what, no matter yeah, what genre. It, it, it makes you feel good. Like um, I watched an interview one time, and Trick, Trick Daddy, for you youngsters don't know what I'm talking about. Trick said, "Music should make you feel something. Yeah, it should make you happy. It should make you sad." It should make you remorseful. Music should evoke some kind of feelings in you. Mm -hmm. That's what music is. Music is a is a is a a 
emotion builder. It's mm -hmm. something that makes everybody feel a certain way. Sometimes it make you mad. You thought about that that woman you know lost. Man, you know what? It used to be our song, and you remember? You know what? I call it with that dude in the car. He was playing this song. You know what I yeah. mean? It, it's gonna make you feel it. That's why music is one of the things I enjoy, and mm -hmm. I know you enjoy music too. We yeah. talk about music all the time. Um, we got some years dealing between us. Yeah. So I just saw music change over the years. Um, back in the day where you could, and we talked about this other day. Back in the day where you could tell where a uh, artist was from by mm -hmm. how he rapped, what he, what kind of clothes he wore, his hairstyle, all of this. Mm -hmm. You could tell where he from. You could tell um, Trick Daddy was from the South. You could tell Biggie was from from mm -hmm. um, New York. You could tell Ice Cube was from from the West Coast. You could tell mm -hmm. this stuff without listening to any music. Now I sometimes I can see a guy on Vivo. I can see him on. Mix, my mix um tapes and I don't quite know where he's from. I hear the music, I see what he look like. I don't quite know until I had to go search and somebody say he say something in his in his in his one of his songs, oh I'm I'm South Side Detroit or something like that. I go, Oh, he's from Detroit. Yeah. I didn't think so. I thought he was from Fort Lauderdale. He got he got dreads and you know he got gold teeth and yeah. it ain't this ain't the same. I think a um a lot of artists these days are taking whatever's hot from any artist and yeah. merging them together and making their persona off of that. That's how it was when, when the Migos came out. Everybody wanted to rap like that. Right, you know? everybody wanted to make that, you know, and it, it, it's not what it's not what you are. People say, oh, this me and this me. Yeah, I don't know because it just so happened, your flow and your charisma and all that look just like somebody else. It's a dude, right? right it's a dude right now. Look him up on Instagram. His name is Slutty uh, uh, Sonny. What? This nigga is... He, he, he look, he look and doing everything just like XX Tentacion. Like look him up, you are gonna be like he he, he look like him. He can't help that, he can't help that he look like him, but he he, he he trying to do everything like him. And then he, he he goes on to say that he's not trying to copy him. He's him, and I I, I get that. that what's his name? Slady what? Son S O. Oh, Sunny, Sunny. I thought you said is <laughs> this uh, Sunny? What's the other? What's the last name? Sunny. Sl slutty. Oh, slutty Sunny. Yeah. Slutty Sunny. Slutty Sunny. I gotta see slutty Sunny because In what? by the name. Let me see images. Slutty Sunny. sunny. Oh, well, that's like a check there. Anyway, I will look it up later because yeah. I, I ain't gonna bore y'all while I'm looking <laughs> up. So let, you you look him up and tell me but what you think about it. But yeah, music is one of them things that you enjoy on the weekend, you know, so, um, yeah. What else? What else? Anything else crazy this week? Nah, I ain't. Everybody I, in for this week? Yeah, I ain't going to give it to him like that. Oh, okay. I, I, I can I can go on. We're trying to keep this video <laughs> to, five, to five minutes. Five minutes. I, I, the way I think about stuff, like, I, I be just wanting to give it to people. And, like, you know, people that, that are just so bitter in their life, well, I'm trying to bring positivity, but I ain't going to do that on this video. Come back next video. Guaranteed to have some more crazy stuff going on. Guaranteed. Cause Guaranteed. The world crazy. Yeah. All right. So we out. There's just a little snippet of what we're going to start doing. We're going to start doing it probably once a week. Depending on how crazy the week is, we may do it twice, three times. Just bringing what we experienced in our life, whatever's in the news we yep. may talk about. But this yep. crazy stuff. Ain't really no format <laughs> for this. We just talking. Yep. Being crazy. Yeah. But the next time, we out. <laughs>